Dorcom and Florence suffered from another fire late last night, and this is the second time in as many weeks. Way 31's Will Robinson Smith reports people were just starting to restore the Laramore house from the first fire when last night's broke out. The Laramore home is not just where the school started, but it's where the Marcel family started. So it, it is. It's like losing a family member. Mm -hmm. It's a family member that Florence Fire Chief Tim Anerton says was severely damaged Thursday night. Around 10 o'clock, fire crews got the call that the Laramore home was once again on fire. But unlike last Wednesday, this time the flames started to take over the historic home. Because it was built back in 1870, firefighters worked especially hard to save as much of the building that served as the foundation for Mars Hill Bible School as possible. Three generations of Holly Bridges' family attended the school at Mars Hill. She says the side of the burning building was, put simply, heartbreaking. I mean, you could just almost literally watch it go from room to room through the windows. So it's, it's I'm, I mean, I'm sure it's a total loss. And it is. It's like watching an old friend kind of fade away. <laughs> Chief Anderton told Way 31 that the fire not only spread to the second floor and then up through the entire attic, but it also managed to burn several large holes in the first floor. Some small pieces of good news are that firefighters were able to save some of the Bibles inside the historic home, as well as one of the pulpits that T.B. Laramore once preached at nearly a century and a half ago. And while other historic artifacts like coat hangers and portraits are now reduced to charred wood and peeling paper, Chief Anderton says he wasn't ready to call the home a total loss just yet. It's a glimmer of hope that perhaps some of this history can still be saved. Reporting in Florence, Will Robinson Smith, Way 31 News.